When you first heard about Oscar Grant, what was your reaction? And then how did those feelings change or, or evolve over time after you met his family? The initial reaction is like, you know, anger. It's like frustration, like, damn, it happened again. Um, how do I stop this from happening? How do I give Oscar his life back? How do, how do I stop the madness from happening? Um, and then, you know, you meet the family and they've had to deal with it firsthand for such a long period, of, like for such a long you know, period of time. And I think it's more like the empathy, the sympathy, you know, that, that you have for, for the family and, and um, that awkwardness, you know, of not saying too much and letting them open up as much as they uh, want to and not pushing, not asking any like wrong questions or anything that might set them off. So I think it was just kind of like, we were, I, I personally just walked on eggshells for the first time meeting them, just, you know, just, and, and then it's also the, the film side of it, you know, like we're about to go in here, we're about to tell a story, you're about to get in, I'm getting ready to portray Oscar, someone that you knew so well. And like, do I stand up to the, to, to the, to the challenge? Do, do, do I even compare to this guy? How could I? ever come close to who Oscar Grant really was, you know, inside his heart. So just trying to figure all that stuff was all the different thoughts and stuff that was all constantly going through my head and uh, when, I, when I met the family. And then it was an added pressure, too, to not let them down, knowing one day his daughter is going to watch this film, you know? Um, and that's a, that's, that's a heavy burden to kind of walk around with, but it's, it's, it's what motivated me every day, too.